And first here at 4 o'clock, a shooting today in Malala sends an area of town into lockdown. Police say the shooter is now in custody. Take a look at this map. It shows where it happened at a house on Main Street. It forced two schools, including Malala River Middle School, to go into lockdown. I want to send it out to our Joe Ranieri, who's live in Malala for us. And Joe, dozens of officers responded. That's right. Good afternoon to you, Brittany and Ashley. Uh, nobody was injured in this shooting, but several hours after the shooting took place, you can still see behind me several police officers. Now, police tell me the shooting took place at that brown house just down the street from me. Now, they've been out here all day investigating what led up to the shooting. We can tell you the suspect was arrested shortly after all this happened. Police were first called out here after a report of a medical call. The chief of police told me while en route is when the suspect put body armor on before opening fire as officers arrived. None of the officers who responded were hurt, but a police cruiser was hit as well as two pickup trucks that were in the area. Here's what Frank Scholenfeld with Malala Chief of Police said about the shooting. They were fired from the house from a, a window uh, adjacent the door um, and uh, small and uh, um, long rifle cut, uh, calibers. Now, nobody inside the home was hurt, but there were two other people inside at the time, including a child. Schools nearby went into lockdown as well as a business in the area. And I spoke with a couple of employees at a local coffee shop just down the street from where we're going live right now, who told me after they heard the shots rang out, they locked down their business and stayed inside until they realized it was safe to come out. Now, the Oregon State Police is investigating this shooting. We're live in Malala this afternoon. Joe Ranieri, KGW News.